Oh! Oh! Oh, he's jumping like crazy! He's all in our lines. Nine jumps! Nine jumps! Nine jumps! Ten jumps! Oh my gosh! What's happening, y'all? Welcome back to another video. Now, today I'm going to do something that is probably more challenging than anything that I've ever done in the history of this channel. All right, I put up a poll yesterday, and y'all voted for me to go try to catch a cobia from land. Easier said than done, folks. But the good thing about it is, even if we don't catch a cobia, we do have a good chance of catching other stuff. But I am going to try my best to catch a cobia because they are migrating down the beaches right now. And in order to do that, we've got to start with the proper bait. All right, so here's what we're going to do. I have my micro rod here. All right, this is a little dock demon. And I've got on the end of it a little tiny hook. And it is baited with a little tiny piece of squid, okay? We are going to catch some live bait right now because that is going to give us the best opportunity to catch something big out here. Woo! We got a lot of wind, guys, right in our face. Watch this. Hopefully we can get us some bait, though. Ooh, there's a bite. There's a bite. Come on. Yep, there he is. There's a fish. Come on, baby. All right, all right. Guys, there is a... That, my friends, is a live pinfish, okay? Whoop, come here. You know anything about cobia? They love pinfish, they love croakers. And so we're going to put them in our little live bucket right there, catch us about a dozen of them. There he is. There's another one. Come here, come here. All right, another pin. Now, these are not big pinfish. I wish I had them a little bigger, but it is better than nothing. All right. We're getting them pretty quick right now. Ooh, there's a bite. Come on. Ooh, got him. Come here, buddy. There we go. A little better one right there. That'll work. Couple more. We're going to be ready to go fishing. We have got us some pretty good baits in there. It is now time to take it to the beach and try to catch us a monster fish. the many great things to enjoy about Pensacola, Florida. So every, I think Tuesday, they have an air show practice out here. So if you're visiting the area, you can come out to the beach and you'll get your own Blue Angel air show. And it's pretty cool. Unfortunately, we have really nasty water today. It's that sweet tea colored water and uh it's usually not good first bait going out guys live pinfish on our small rod and we're just throwing this out just in case something comes riding the beach right here we're not going to put it out very far <clears throat> So folks, we got three rods set out right now, all with live pinfish in the deep water. And you can see the deep water right out here off the beat. Oh shoot, our big rod guys, our big rod got hit. You gotta be kidding me. Oh my gosh. First bait to get, get whacked today. Woo! All right. That's cool. I'll take it. That pinfish stayed out there like 10 minutes and got whacked. Woo! It's a drag screamer, whatever it is, guys. What I'm, uh, it has zero head shake, man. That's not good. 
If it is a ray, it's a giant. My gosh. There ain't much I can do with it. You got here just in time. You can go take my stingray off the hook for me. I knew you had a ray when I was coming around the corner up there. Look at look at who just I shows was like, up. He's got a big old ray on. Hold my rod for me real quick so I can go take him off the hook. Where's he at? Right out there. I ate a live pinfish. All right, guys, let's go get this thing taken care of right here. Guys, look at the size of that ray dude he is absolutely massive that may be my pb ray right there at least want to get my sputnik back here oh he broke it broke off right there there he goes golly the line broke we're getting another pinfish going right here on a big rod just to uh we got to keep multiple rods going no more stingrays all right There we go. That was a great cast. That's where I wanted it, right there. My subscribers were get, beginning to think you didn't care about them no more. What are you talking about, man? I love you guys. Yeah, well, you, you know, they I mean, they did were you like, even bother telling them that, like, I've had some medical issues over the last two months? Like, with my he, he didn't even whatnot. tell me. He had Whatever. You knew full and well I hadn't been doing it. All right. Let's see. I've had some kidney issues, but we got it all worked out. We're good to go. Let's see you get this it out. This is my first time ever casting an 11-foot rod. Well, let's see you get it out there. I'm going to get it out there as far as I can. Bro, that was weak. That, that, was, that was weak. <laughs> when I would run fishing charters, right off this drop off where we're casting here there's structure all through our pass and this time of year through may we would catch cobias coming in and out of the pass on bottom rigs while we're uh, you know bottom fishing for whatever redfish and other stuff on the structure so that's why i thought i had a had an opportunity out here if it is oh is it on the bummy stick no the bummy stick's in the middle you almost lost your rod. Did you catch that? This is a brand new setup too, guys. He almost lost his rod. Let me go get him for you. Let me go get him for you. That's a good one, Ron. Heck yeah. Arr. Dude, nice fish, dude. So that was your very first beach redfish, it wasn't was. it? That's, That's cool. That's the first like, game fish, so to speak, I've ever caught from beach. Side Pompano. Pompano, yeah. Um, most of it's always been catfish, shark, whatever, but yeah. So guys, we got seven rods out right now. One, two, three, four, five, and then two big ones on the end. And uh, we've got a mixture of baits. We've got pinfish, we've got bonita, we have shrimp. Uh, and so we're kind of prepared for everything out here. Oh, 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 oh. Big fish, big fish, big fish. Oh, he's jumping like crazy. Oh my gosh, he's jumping like crazy. This fish has jumped like seven times, eight times, eight times, eight jumps. Oh my gosh. He's all in our lines. Nine jumps, nine jumps, nine jumps, ten jumps. Oh my gosh. Ten jumps, dude. <sighs> I don't care, that's all right. That's okay. Try to get him to go out. Heck yeah. Woo hoo hoo! Such a different hit when a game fish hits it versus those rays. When a ray hits it, you've got that smooth bend in your rod. But when something like this hits it, dude, he jumped 10 times. It. it was wild. Such a cool catch. Here he comes. Look, here he comes. See him right there? Go out there and uh, eat him, Ron. <laughs> Look at him right there. Coming into the beach. What's that? Okay, yeah, I don't know if that'll work either. I'll pull him by the tail and get him up on the beach. So Ron, you're gonna get an opportunity here to redeem yourself. Yeah, I'm gonna eat that 
So, here. no, what I want you to do, I'm going to take the camera. I want you to go grab him by the tail and drag him up on the beach. Oh, my gosh. He's a good one. All right, Ron, that's a big one. Go grab. getting closer than that. I ain't getting in that deep. No, no, no. Grab him by the tail and pull him backwards. He's going to spin around and eat me. Uh, you got to closer, like where he can't swim, and then I'll grab him. All right, go grab him before he gets in our rods. He's going to get tangled. Just grab him. That's a good one, too. Golly. That's a good one. Bro. All right, grab him by, <laughs> All right, grab him by the tail, Here, dude. Here, two lanes are on shark. I'm not trying to get eaten today. Here, hold this, and I'll get him. Good gracious. He tried to eat me, Brent. <laughs> He is messed up. All right, what I'm gonna do, here, let's, let's get some pliers and get the hook out of his mouth. Hold his head down, and I'm gonna take the hook out of his mouth. I'll, uh, further up, further up, further up, further up, further up. Right, right there, little foot right here. Hold him down like hardcore, dude. There it is, hook out of his mouth, right there. All right, Ron, drag him backwards. Take him out. <laughs> you got this, bro. That's a nice, That's nice spot. All right, hurry real quick before he gets hurt. Yeah, I better drag him no, you ball. just drag him backwards. Straight backwards. Straight backwards. There you go. Cont hurry up. Just like you're backpedaling. Keep going. No, 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 no. Keep going. Keep going. That way. That way. You're good. You're perfect. You're perfect, dude. That's it. That was not quite it, but that'll do. There he goes, guys. <laughs> wow, what a cool beach catch. That was a cool beach catch. Good job, Ron. Good job, dude. Hey, shark tossing champion 2022. I need that trophy. Guys, let's pl let's let's show the shark eating toss right now. Yeah. This is the first this is his first experience with sharks. For the water. No, 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 no. You walking back. Oh. There's a bunch of bait going nuts over here. I'm going to throw this uh, pinfish right in the middle of it and just see. Ah. There we go. That's a decent throw. Decent throw. Guys, we got a big fish on at the end down here. Good gracious. Oh, that's a good one. That's on my small rod. Or this could be a shark. Could be a shark. Got a little head shake. What are you doing down here on my end of the beach anyways? I, I, want, I want to show y'all something. Y'all look where Brant's at right here. These are my three rods. Brant was down there. And now all of a sudden Brant's got a sand spike. And down here on the east side of the beach. What are you doing on the east side? You're more of a I'm west side guy. You. You're more of a west side guy. <laughs> Actually, you're more of an uptown guy, honestly, if we're being real here. But you know what we don't need to happen now is like more rods go off. Yeah, we do. We always need rods to go off. What are you talking about? This sucker's got some weird head shape. Whatever it is, it's coming in hardcore. Man. I can't believe I forgot a belt of all days. Look at him out there on top. I think it was. Was that a stingray? Heck, I don't know. I didn't see it. Heck yeah. That's what I wanted right there. For me. Bro, everybody in the country knows about this. Would you have known to come here today? I come here all the time. I don't ever catch no fish. <laughs> That's a big girl. Hey man, your your good luck. Ever since you walked up, we started catching fish. I know. And I, he just hey, he just start what you you just started your channel today, didn't yeah, you? Therapeutic fishing. Therapeutic guys, fishing. Classy. All right, he caught a big redfish out here today. Y'all go check him out. Grab him by the tail. If you lose my fish for me, there we go. There we go. Oh, that's a giant, dude. Heck yeah. 
Heck oh, yeah. That is a that is a studly. Five inches. Check out that sucker right there, guys. What a bull. <laughs> what a bull. Let's go in this clear water right here to release him. There we go. Big girl right there. Woo! hundred feet out there they don't look as big. Nah. -uh. Uh, well that, is, that was incredible. The re I didn't get the target fish, which was a cobia, but that was not a total loss, was it? You were catching a cobia. Out That's here what today. I was trying for. Good lord. That's what I was trying for. Well you failed at one but succeeded at a lot of others. So it was a you gotta say that was an eventful day. Dude, I mean it was a, probably one of the best bites we've ever had on the beach. We never had a dull moment, and we lost a lot of fish that we just did. hit, and we missed them and stuff like that. So we that was awesome. We caught an osprey online. Like that was <laughs> awesome. <laughs>